Hi everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. This video will be an S&P Capital IQ Pro tutorial. If you work in finance, equity research, PE or VC, corporate strategy or banking, then you've probably heard of S&P Capital IQ Pro. It is an all-in-one platform that has many pros using it to find company data, track markets and turn filings into clear insights fast. If you would like to get a personalized demo from S&P Global and get access to a guided walkthrough, then go ahead and navigate to the link in the description below this video. But right now, essentially, I'm going to walk you through exactly how it works, what it actually is and how you can use it and why people use it in the first place. So Capital IQ Pro sits inside S&P Global Market Intelligence. You can think of it as a research room, deep fundamentals on public and private companies, real-time market data, transcripts and filings, plus AI helpers that speed up the grunt work. S&P has been rolling out Gen AI features like Chat IQ, an AI assistant, and document intelligence, an AI that pulls key facts from large docs. That way you can move from a question to an answer more quickly than before. The way you can get in is that you want to go to the S&P Global Market Intelligence and then request a demo or trial access. After you get set up, you will log into Capital IQ Pro from the Market Intelligence site. And if you need to work in Excel or PowerPoint, you simply install Capital IQ Pro Office, which is the Office add-in from S&P site. It pipes live data into spreadsheets and decks. Now, when you first land in Capital IQ Pro, you will see a global search bar at the top and a left-hand menu for companies, markets, screening, news and filings and transcripts and watch lists. The platform is modular, so the best way to learn is to build one workflow start to finish. But essentially, the way you can build a watch list to anchor your day is that you search a ticker or company name and then click add to watch list. You can do this for your own coverage range like customers, comps, targets or portfolio names. And then once saved, the watch list view shows prices, news, estimates, snapshots and rating changes in a single pane. You set alerts for each list so you are pinged when filings hit or when prices move or ownership changes. You can set alerts to email or keep them in a dashboard feed, real time or scheduled. The second step is to open a company tear sheet. As you can click on any name to open its company profile, you will find business description, financials, estimates, ownership, people, transactions and M&A and more. This is your single source of truth for quick questions like what was revenue growth last year or who are the top owners. The profile pulls from S&P's deep fundamentals database that spans public and private firms. You can try this, you can jump to the filings and transcripts and then use document intelligence to auto extract KPIs, guidance and risk language from a 10k or earnings call without reading 100 plus pages end to end. It's designed to find the numbers and sections that you care about first. Also at any point you can open chat IQ and type a natural language question such as summarize last quarter's results for a company or list the top revenue drivers mentioned in the most recent earnings call. Chat IQ returns a concise answer, links you back to the source document and then can generate charts or quick tables that you can export. It's purpose built for financial research and draws on Capital IQ Pro's content, not the web application. Now from the left menu, you can open screening. Pick companies if you are in equity or strategy or fixed income if you are in credit. For an equity screen, you can set basic filters like country, industry and market cap. And then add fundamentals like TTM revenue growth, EBIT margin, net debt, etc. And then you add the valuation, EV or sales, EV or EBITDA, P&E, and then save the view so you can refresh it in just a click. For credit and rates, you can use the fixed income tools to explore bonds and issuers, terms, coupons, maturities, ratings, and all of that. You can slice by ratings, moves, or yield or upcoming maturities. Also, if you are in the PE or VC or core dev, you can switch to private markets or transactions, pull profiles on private companies, track fundraising rounds, or map sponsor backed deals, scan M&A comps and view cap table or valuation data points when available. Use it for market mapping. So who are the Series B cybersecurity firms in the US with ARR over $10 million? deal comps and target lists. And before you log off, you can create alerts that match your coverage, filings 10k per quarter or 8k, earnings press releases, rating changes, transcript uploads, price or spread moves, insider trades and ownership changes. Choose delivery and frequency that fits how you work. 
real time for filings or ratings, moves, daily digests, foreign news. Alerts keep you informed without living on the screen. Now here is where Capital IQ Pro shines, it's the breadth plus the workflow. You get company fundamentals, public and private, filings and or transcripts, news, ownership, deals and credit data in one place. Plus tools to screen, chart, export and alert without actually putting together 10 platforms. The new AI utilities lower the cost of answering first mile questions so you can spend more time on analysis, not copy paste. The office add-ins keep models and decks synced which is all huge for team quality control. As for where to watch out and what to watch out for, first of all, we've got the learning curve as it is a professional tool with a lot of depth. You need to plan on a few sessions to get truly fast. And then we have the seat licensing and access as pricing is quote based and varies by modules. We've got equity, credit, private markets, office, add-ins, etc. So you wanna expect to work with sales on scope, it isn't a self-serve monthly tool. So again, you want to use the link in the description to book yourself a demo and then map features to your use case before you commit. But overall, Capital IQ Pro remains a top choice for teams that need reliable data coverage, tight office integration, and end-to-end -end workflows. Now with AI that actually saves time. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you have found it to be helpful or informative to watch, let us know by giving us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos relating to this one.